Hey everybody, it's your boy FirstBits01, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be opening up the WWE Ultimate Edition Jeff Hardy for this action figure review. So we're going to be opening up Jeff Hardy in this review. Anyways, so we all know he's going through some rough times right now, but we're going to not focus on that, focus on the positive. So we got a picture of Jeff Hardy on the side of the box here. And this is him rocking his classic 2002-2003 attire back in the day. Because even though I was a baby back then, because, you know, it was around 2001, but even though I wasn't watching wrestling because I was still a baby. If you guys want to read and pause about the great legacy of Jeff Hardy and WWE, go right on ahead. And go ahead and read this part two this what read this part two as well. And then you have this right here as well. So without further ado, let's open up the box here. Alrighty guys, so I just opened up the package. When you first open it, it'll have wording on top, which if you get an Ultimate Edition, it will come with this, so there you go. So I just wanted to let you know, just a little quick bonus. Also, there will be words at the top and bottom, so don't forget, it says no more words. So just want to let you know, every Ultimate Edition is going to have this on the bottom and top, so just to get that out of the way, just to let you know. Alright everybody, here he is out of the packaging, so we got Jeff Hardy out of the good old box here so he is looking very good rocking his classic 2000 slash 2002 look in his prime very very unique you got some uh, butterfly joints going on here in the arm socket here you can definitely bend his arm a little bit uh this part definitely goes 60 degrees there we go yep that goes 60 degrees here uh double jointed elbows which is very nice Try to be very careful here without. There we go, just bending it like so. So I have to do it off camera so I know what I'm doing. Alright, cool. So, same thing on the other side with the classic butterfly joints. Oh, wait, hold on. Sorry, the, the camera didn't see it. Hold on, let's, let's start over. Like so. There we go. Of course, he has that classic Chef Hardy necklace, double jointed elbows. This also moves 60 degrees. It's going 60 degrees pretty well, so that's pretty good here. Uh, we got some, uh, the chest can move up a little bit and it can slightly go down, up, down, up, down. You can move like this, but you can't, you can't move it slash twist it. Only the bottom part right here, which is the stomach waist area. Then you can do the splits here, which is nice. And the knees on his right can bend including his left he can also bend and go this way like so pretty good for the most part um you can only bend the footsies up and down up and down like so uh, i don't think we're going to be getting we might get just a tiny bit of ankle pivot just not a whole lot though so so for this ankle pivot not so bad i'll have to give it at least an honestable six out of ten I kind of want to go for a 10 out of 10 out of this one, but I'm going to have to go with 6 out of 10. So, still not that bad, but it needs a little bit of work. This needs a little bit of work, that's all. So, the head goes 60 degrees here. And, of course, if you want to pop the head and give him the crazy, I'm about to go extreme, take the head off, like so. And you take his screaming one right here. I'll have to do this off camera here so so I know what I'm doing and you just push it in either if you hear a click or it just pushes right in naturally and there you go Jeff Hardy's about to go extreme on y'all look at that you don't want to mess with this Jeff Hardy dude don't you I don't think so I do not think so I like the details of the paint and the painting of his arms on his uh, left arm of course and then of course he has a uh, ripped socks as sleeves so that's pretty interesting of course so uh i like the pants kind of giving me barber the brief Bar barber the brief cake vibes a little bit with the stripes the zebra stripes a little bit and of course there's a little hole on the bottom of his like back pocket you can put this little towel thingy thingy majig and just slide it on there Hopefully you didn't see that. Um, 
you just push it right in and there you go. It's supposed to stay on there, but it kind of does come off anyway, so it is a little distracting, so I will have it off just to make it simple. So, uh, okay, let's go ahead and move on with the uh, figure's articulation of the hand. So you can move that, we'll move it up and down, of course, up, down, up, down. And then all you got to do is just pull it off if you want to go for the classic Jeff Hardy look, that which we all know and love. Sorry, I keep next bumping into wrestling boxes. Again, here we go again. My bad. So, I'm going to go with uh, the classic shooter hands. <clears throat> Excuse me, my voice, my voice is a little dry. I apologize for that. I might need to drink some water after this. So, uh, here he is doing the bang bang shooter hands. And then, of course, you have the, um, the typing hand slash proposal hand slash... Ninja Warrior hands, thingamajigs, but I'm going to go for the classic shooter hands that he also does all the time. So, put it in the right arm, you just push it like so, I hear a click, there you go, got one in, got to get the second one in there too, like so. Awesome, there you go, and then you can do his iconic little pose that he does. Let me get it to work here. There we go. Because he's Jeff Hardy. Uh, yep, there you go. Yep, he's doing the classic pose. And then he can do his little dance. Like so, when he's doing this. going. You, you guys know what I'm talking about. You guys know what I'm talking about. Or the classic... Uh, or this pose right here. Oh yeah, that's that's iconic right there. He's good at doing some classic shooter hands and all that good stuff, so. Yep, oops, sorry. Sorry for hitting the camera, my bad. Unless you want to go for the classic regular hands that we all know and love, just take those off, like so, no big deal. And then you just put regular hands on, so. Yeah, there you go. Do whatever. Of course, we have his classic sleeveless t-shirt of a picture of him. So I know this might be a little bit weird. I thought I was having a um uh what's it called the Medela effect. I I thought I almost had a Medela effect on this shirt because what happened was because when I saw the figure, I thought, hey, I wonder if he's gonna have the uh the classic logo. You, you know what I'm talking about, the one on the necklace I was showing you a minute ago. The video, I thought we were gonna get like a green one, just like this one, but. I guess not, because I think it was supposed to go on the, that figure. Unless I'm mistaken on another figure, but just want to let you guys know that. So all you got to do is just take it off. There's Velcro on the back, so let's slide some arms in here on Jeff Hardy. And there you have it. And then you take the Velcro, like so. And you just let it attack, attach to it in the back. There you go. Jeff Hardy's got us t-shirt on and he's ready to go so there you go and that is about it on jeff hardy so this is his last wwe figure for the ultimate edition series unless if i want to get the other one and review it i'm not really sure i have no idea if we're going to get any more jeff hardy figures in the future in general for 2023 slash 2024 because we all know jeff hardy's going a few he's going through a few problems which I will not mention you probably know what I'm talking about I'm probably sure it has been mentioned so many times on YouTube but people talk about Jeff Hardy and his you know DUIs and all that good stuff but hopefully he comes back bees better than that and you know all that good stuff and maybe we can get an AEW run with Jeff Hardy maybe he could become world champion just for a little bit and then maybe finally safely to say retire from wrestling for good so we don't know what the next chapter is for jeff hardy and we have no idea what's next for matt hardy because matt hardy he's wrestling all by himself in AEW, so had to put that out there but anyways thank you so much for watching if you want to see more videos like that one go check out my playlist for every single action figure review that i ever do or go check out my lego videos i have a bunch of them watch on all i have a bunch of them on my channel so please go check them out i'm gonna go ahead and get out of here and go clear up my throat drink some water all that good stuff see you guys next time you guys rock don't forget it please leave a like comment and subscribe peace out